Hey guys, good morning. Welcome to today's video. So I'm out and about. Um, I came to check on the house. Um, we always come and check on our house just randomly throughout the day because uh, I guess we're paranoid <laughs> for whatever reason. But um, so I did that and then I went and sent off two more Pokemon cards that Justin sold. And now I'm just kind of driving around. I told you guys in the yesterday's video that I might go look for some garage sales. So I drove past one and it looked like a bunch of just totes full of clothes and stuff like that. So don't need anything like that. So I'm going to keep on just driving around a few neighborhoods and seeing if I can see any, you know, like TV stands or night stands or anything like that. And um, that's pretty much all I'm looking for right now. So I'm not really like... I don't know. I, I, I can garage sale any weekend. Like, um, I was going to say I'm not really in the mood to garage sale, but I like going to garage sales. It's just I don't like going by myself. And it's Friday, of course, so everybody's at work. Um, so I kind of have to go by myself. But um, that's why I'm just going to drive by. And if I see anything that looks good, I'll get out. But if it doesn't look too good, I'll just stay in the car and keep on driving. So, anyways, that is what I'm doing this morning. It is uh, about 11 o'clock already. So I'll be heading home shortly to have some lunch and all that good stuff. I just wanted to say hello and good morning and start my video. So like I said, I'm going to go check and see if I can find any good deals at some garage sales. And then I am going to head home. So I am back home. No success at any garage sales. But I have my food heating up. That's probably too loud for you guys. Um, I have my food heating up in the microwave. And... Um, God, the little tray thing is off track in the microwave, so it's making a lot of noise. But anyways, um, I was going to tell y'all, we don't have our um, table over here yet. We do have one at the other house, if you missed whatever vlog it was that I said that in. Um, we do have like a dining room table. It's an old one. My parents had it like several, several years ago. And then like um, when we moved into our house... They were getting a new one, so they gave us their old one, and um, and we moved into our house like oh, almost nine years ago, so it's probably at least like 12, 13 years old, um, and so um, it's obviously not in the best condition, and so what I was thinking is since our kind of the theme of our like home decor and stuff so far is like white and gray, I thought it would be cool to um, take the legs off of the table and then um, sand them down and sand, well, sand the whole entire table down, but take the legs off, paint the legs white, and then like the bottom part of the table white, and then paint the top or do the top in like a stain, a gray stain. I think that would look really good. Um, so that's kind of my idea for it anyways. Um, so I need to get that done sometime. I might, maybe this weekend if we have time, um, I will start sanding the table down and seeing how far I can get with that. But yeah, I think that would be fun. A fun little project to do. Um, I'm excited to get our table over here and have uh, other places to sit and just get our furniture, our furniture, get our apartment um, coming together with all the furniture. So Justin and I were also talking about the living room last night and what we wanted to do because since we're going to be having two love seats, um, it might, it's probably going to look a little funny to most people because you usually have a love seat and a sofa but again it wouldn't fit into our apartment so um, I think we're gonna have we have one love seat here I think we're gonna do the other love seat over there on that wall and then instead of having the TV over here on the front house wall I think we might put it over here and then that way where we have the TV now we can put another like chair and maybe um, a side table or like a what are those tables called? Kind of like a sofa table, but it's like the long skinny ones that you can put on the wall and maybe we'll have like some, just some decor on top of it or something like that. So we've just been trying to think of some ideas, um, how to work with the furniture that we're going to have to have in here. Um, so yeah, if you guys have any cute pictures or ideas, um, our couches are gray. And then I think, I don't know if we're going to get gray chairs to match or what we're going to do so far, but I am going to eat my lunch because I am freaking hungry. It's 12 o'clock now. And uh, yeah, I'm probably going to watch some friends while I eat and just have a chillaxing lunch. Well, guys, I just realized that earlier when I went to check on the house, I was also suppo supposed to grab the water bill and go and pay it because um, I think it's due on like the weekend 
like Sunday, which is a weird day to have a payment due because they're not open. Um, and I don't think they're open tomorrow either. So I'm going to go ahead and go run and grab that and go pay it, I guess. Um, cause I need to get that done. And then, yeah, I think that's all I have to do. I need to get gas eventually cause we are on empty, but we'll, we'll get it some other time. Dang it guys, I must've taken the bill to our apartment and just forgot about it or something cause I couldn't find it at our house. So I'm just gonna go up there and give them my address and hopefully I can pay it that way because I don't wanna go back and forth a million freaking times. I should have remembered that I took it over there. Um, I guess, cause I couldn't find it at the house. So anyways, I'm losing my mind a little bit, but I'm on my way to go pay that bill. I just, I can't believe I forgot. We just had so much going on lately that that's my excuse anyway. I am back at the apartment and I think I'm going to um, play a couple games of Fortnite. I haven't played in a while um, and I'm pretty bored. So I think I might play a couple games and then I'm going to start working on my video. Getting that edited and posted for you guys. And then I don't know what I'm going to do after that. It's just a mystery. I guess we'll find out together. All right. So I played a few games of Fortnite. Um, it's not as fun when you play alone. So I only played a couple. But um, I am now going to edit the video. It is about 3.36. I've been trying to edit it a little bit earlier than usual. I usually try to get it posted around 6 um, or just before 6. I don't know. I just feel like that's when most people are getting off work or whatever. But I guess if you think about it, as soon as people get off work, they're like thinking about dinner plans and all that stuff. So I have a pimple, by the way. Ignore it. It's nasty, but... Anyways, um, they're like getting ready for dinner or like hanging out with family and stuff like that. So I figure any time is probably a good time to post it because people will just watch it whenever they get a chance. So, um, plus I have been like, sometimes I'll, I won't start editing until like 4.30, 5 o'clock. And then if it's a longer video, which they have been lately, um, it takes a lot more time to edit and, and upload and everything. So I start running into our dinner time and then we eat a little bit later than we probably should. So I've been trying to start editing around 3, 3.30, even 4 at the latest. But um, anyway, so I'm going to start editing the video, get that posted for you guys. And then what I realized also is that um, I wanted to make the, <sighs> my computer's making all kinds of dang noise. I wanted to make those quesadilla burgers with Justin. Um... Because, like I said, it would be fun. I think that would be a really fun meal for us to cook together. But when we went and ordered our groceries from, like, the Walmart pickup thing, we only ordered enough for, like, four or five days. And it's already been that long. So, yeah, I think that's all we have left. Well, we have chicken. We can make... I don't know. I'm craving those quesadilla burgers. So I think I'm just going to make them on my own. Um, maybe if Justin feels like it when he gets off, he can help me finish them up and uh all that good stuff but if not it's fine i just want to try them i'm just i'm ready to, to taste them and see how they turn out and um if they turn out good i'll give you guys the recipe but anyway i'm gonna focus on getting this video finished and then we will worry about dinner i'm editing the video as you guys know and if you can see up there it says not responding my freaking editing software froze yet again this editing software i love it but i hate it i love it because of the simplicity and it's like it's a really decent video editing software and everything but I hate it because it freezes all the freaking time and it messes me up all the time by the way while I'm editing this video and all the other videos that I edit I feel like I'm always filming way up close to my face I don't know why it's just a habit I guess I'm used to just holding my phone out like without extending my arm but I need to I feel like I need to get in the habit of extending my arm out because when I'm editing my video I'm like god you can see up my freaking nose and all that good stuff because I literally have the camera on my forehead. So I'm going to try to start extending my arm when I vlog because I'm getting tired of seeing up my nose and you probably are too. But anyways, I hope this freaking thing works itself out. Usually it doesn't and I have to re-edit the whole video and it's been sitting here like this for like three minutes now. So I think I'm just going to edit or exit out and re-edit the video as much as I want to um, have to redo it and start over. At least I'm only like three, four minutes in um and not all the way finished like when it normally happens i'll be fixing to save my video and it'll crash and i'm like oh great now i have to start over but at least this time it messed up in like the early part of the video so anyways i guess i'm gonna x this out and restart it um but i just thought i would say i need to stop 
recording so close to my face. I think it's because it's easier to hold it closer like this. Your arm doesn't get as tired as quickly, whereas it gets tired pretty quickly when you're holding it out further. So I think that's probably what it is. But anyway, I need to get a new little tripod, like just the small little hand held one, because that also helps me hold it farther away because it's just easier to hold the camera when it's on a tripod thing. But anyways, I'm going to shut the hell up now and uh, try to figure out what's going on with my video. I finally got my video edited um, and figured out. And now, guys, as much as I love having our own washer and dryer, there is something that I've noticed I do um, now that we have one. And when you go to the laundromat, you always have to, like, you know, get your clothes out of the dryer and fold them right then and there because you got to, you know, get your clothes and go. But since we live here and we have the washer and dryer here, I'll do a load of laundry and then I'll forget that they're in the dryer. Um, so I have the laundry still in the dryer from yesterday that I did. And I completely forgot about it until I was just randomly sitting there thinking of random things because I'm a weirdo. And um, I realized I left the clothes in the dryer and I never did get them out and fold them. So I'm going to do that real quick when my video saves and get that done. And then it's only like 4.30 so I don't want to start dinner like super early or anything. So... I guess I'll find some stuff to do until it's about dinner time and then I'm gonna start working on that. So we'll see. Okay guys, I am now working on dinner and I have the burgers in here. They're pretty thin, but I made them pretty big around because like I said, we're trying to make, we're trying to put it in a tortilla and obviously the tortillas are a little bit bigger than a burger patty. So we might have to cut the tortilla a little bit, but I tried to squish them out as good as I could. And then here I have some bacon chopped up and then some purple onion or red onion, whatever you guys prefer to call it. Um, and I'm going to cook it once these burgers get done. And then the onion and bacon are to go in the sauce that we make. Um, it's basically just like ketchup, mayonnaise, mustard, um, pickle relish, or you can just chop up pickles and put it in there. Sriracha and then we're gonna add onion and bacon this time so i'm pretty sure that's all of it um and then you just put it on top of the burger and then you um add some cheese and then you put the tortilla after you grill the tortilla you put it around the burger and then you eat it so that's what the goal is anyway hopefully it's as easy as i'm making it sound because this is our actually first time making it like this um we've made the burgers with the sauce before without the onion and bacon and then just on a regular hamburger bun, but we've never quite made them like this. So I'm excited to try them and I'm excited to see how they turn out. But that is what I have going so far. It is six o'clock, so Justin should be coming home pretty soon. I just realized that we had some of the ingredients at our other house for this meal and um, we never did bring them over, but when we were making the grocery list, we were like, oh, we don't need to get that because we have it at the other house. And we still haven't gone to get it. So I had to call Justin and, um, He's stopping to get it on his way home. But yeah, we left the mustard and the sriracha over there. So, two pretty key ingredients. So he's gonna stop on his way home, grab those, and then I have the burgers done. The bacon and onion are just about done. Um, and then we just gotta throw it all together. Okay guys, Justin's home, and this is what we created. It looks pretty good. The tortillas are still way too big, even though I flattened the burger out. But I mean, it looks good for the first try. So Justin's gonna taste that and we'll let you know how it is. I'm finishing up mine over here and then we're gonna enjoy. Uh, my camera doesn't really pick it up very well but this freaking moon is crazy. I know. All right guys, we are now getting gas. Uh, we went to Walmart. That's where I filmed the moon. Um, you know, because we are addicted to for looking, oh my God, I can't even talk. Addicted to looking for those Pokemon cards. <laughs> they still didn't have any. Um, but we did get some razors. I got some razors. Um, I've been using the same one for like a couple months, which is awful. And it didn't hardly shave worth of crap anymore anyways. So I finally got some new ones. And then, um, well, we got like a fall smelling candle. I think it's called apple pumpkin. It smelled pretty good. And Justin got some gum. My mom and Brian, my younger brother, get this Mentos gum. And they got Justin uh, wanting some. So... We got him some of that, and that's pretty much it. Now we're getting gas, and then we're going to head back home and watch some Shameless. We've been wanting to watch it 
all day long or at least I have Justin's been at work so he probably hasn't thought about it too much but anyways um he's going to where is he going oh what is he doing I think he's seeing if their air pressure thing for the tires work because um he needs to air up his tires again on the suburban and last time we came here theirs didn't work but anyways um I don't even remember what the heck I was saying I <laughs> He's a weirdo. I have been talking, to, or I have been wanting to watch Shameless all day. He's been at work, so he probably hasn't thought about it too much. But he was just like, we gotta go home and watch Shameless. So we were on the same page. But anyways, like I said, that is the plans um, for now. So I think we're gonna go home and probably call it night. So thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you guys tomorrow.